All right, one last keep it going. Not recording mementos really helped my voice. So I think that it should be recorded. That's why I'm that's why I'm able to do another keep it going. It should be in here because I looked around and I was looking at all the, all the other things you can go through. And I think it was near here. Yeah, here it is. This is the council room. What were we called in for? This is rather strange. Oh man. What you want? Huh? Ah, earlier than expected. Yeah, I headed right over there. I'll get straight to the point. Mr. Kamashida and Matarame. Won't you tell me the truth behind the Phantom Thieves incidents? Mm. Can't answer that? Oh, of course. There's no way you would admit to such things. Have a listen. Dude, why do you think it's me so bad? If someone else could help him, we wouldn't be doing stuff as the Phantom Thieves to start with. Dude, what is this? If someone else could help him? <laughs> Dude, what is this? So you think it's true? We'll be okay if we keep doing this, right? What could all this mean? We screwed up. Was it blackmail? Hypnosis? How do you corner someone into making them confess? Won't you tell me how you did it? Dude, what are you talking about? You weird oh man. What if we were just talking about some like weird off-topic thing, man? Get out of here, Makado man. Stinky eye principal puppet. Not sure what you mean. Literally no life, man. Principal forcing you to dog on top of us, man. Like hop on like a dog, just like sniffing us out and everything, man. That's the culprit. <laughs> Dude, no idea. Yeah, that's the culprit, bro. You want to say that this doesn't prove anything, don't you? I believe that you three are the Phantom Thieves. Well, you're crazy. Now, what would the police think if they heard my recording? It'd be bad if we're put under police surveillance. There's no telling what'll happen to you, too. If you confess the truth, I don't mind just leaving this between the two of us. Yeah, right, You'll Principal Puppet. Me, won't you? I have a right, Marie, to be silent. Mm -hmm. That's the same like as you're not gonna truth, snitch. You know. The same as what did you just say? The same as admitting to it? Mm-mm, I got rights, man. Go ahead. Just because I said I did it. Just because I want to be silent doesn't mean I did it. Come on, man. Come on, man. Hey, where you at? Taking a leak? <laughs> Let's meet up at the usual spot Dude. to hold our Phantom Thieves meeting. Dude! Oh, this guy! There's no way! A Phantom Thieves meeting. That idiot! <laughs> Dude. As loud as always. But his timing's perfect. I'd like everyone else to hear this as well. Won't you take me to your friends? I guess it can't be helped now. Alright, well, of course you're just turning to the Phantom Thief. Yeah. Oh. This creep man, get out of here. Hmm? Here? Is he gonna is she gonna end up like uh like this guy, Yusuke, who was like crazy for the nude model, which is like a weird intro, then like turns fine over time, like he's all right now. Well we'll see what happens now. Is that girl a friend of yours? What the, what the hell? What's the meaning of this? Yeah, I mean, it's principal, principal puppet. Lily cannot do anything, man. Yo, like, Lily, what is she supposed to do except, like, find them? Why? I don't even know, man. I'm just not gonna stop talking. I had him lead me here. Ryuji Sakamoto. On to Kamaki. And you're Kitagawa-kun, correct? Second year at Kosei High and former pupil of Madarame. Dude, how do you know this? Weirdo, man. I wanted to ask you all about this. If someone else could help him, we wouldn't be doing stuff. An extremely similar technique was used for both Kamashita and Madarame. Dude, we would we would not have been caught if it wasn't for you, Principal Puppet. Literally no liking around us, man. I don't believe this, man. Like live your own life, bro. I guess it was forced upon you, but still, I cannot believe this, man. While those affected by their acts were just coincidentally meeting up. Affected by their acts were... How could that not raise suspicions? What do you intend to do? Have you come just to say you're going to report us? Yeah, you scared to tell them to this principal puppet. I bet someone told you to find us. The school can't have ties to criminals, after all. And yet they turn a blind eye when it comes to suicide and sexual harassment. Oh, man. Too crazy. It's 4v1, Makado. What are you gonna do? Those adults are just using you. 
I feel sorry for you. Oh man, she's bitten. I, I know. Huh? That's why I would like to verify the justice you speak of. What? I'm the only one who knows about you. If you prove what you're doing is just, I'll erase this. Mm -hmm, yeah, I'm sure I'll trust you, Principal Puppet. She wants to make a deal. I'm only trusting you because you're on the box cover art. You know that, right? <laughs> you're not. <laughs> That's a dumb reason. You're on the box cover art. It's a canon event, okay? It's the only reason I'm trusting you. <laughs> there is someone whose heart I'd like you to change. Oh man, we're gonna find him. the next big target. Who? It's gonna be hit the target. Oh, like Stampy reference. Too crazy, man. So you're not saying it's impossible. However, I cannot tell you that just yet. Let's continue our talk after school tomorrow. On the roof. What are you gonna tell the principal, man? Oh, like I could have won the Phantom Thieves. I just became one, you know. Come on, join the Phantom Thieves with us. We have like a principal on the team. Yeah, that'd be crazy. Assuming you accept my offer, that is. Oh man, okay. It's just turning into a real pain. Dude, she's literally Miss Pee Pee, man, Principal Puppet. I could call her that instead, I don't even know. You were careless. I don't think you truly understood how high the stakes were. Anything to say, Ryuji? Why are you singling me out? On got recorded too, you know? Oh, man. I'm so sorry. Hey, what should we do? That girl's got dirt on us. A recording seems to be insufficient evidence, though. And even with that, there's no way they could prove our methods. Considering who we're dealing with, I think it might be a trap. Mm -hmm. Regardless, this guy would be in real trouble. He's on probation, after all. Things would get rough if we didn't have our leader. And I totally don't want to deal with the police. Then, we have no other choice but to go along with it. Yeah, yeah, I know. I shouldn't be too hard at Makado. She'll probably, you know, get better. But like right now, she's acting pretty stinky, man. I like the past few times we've seen her, you know. Yes, it's best we agree, at least for the time being. We made a crucial mistake, but not a critical one. We'll just have to recover from here on out. Yeah, yeah, my bad. So. We doing this? Dude, that was crazy though. Oh, yo, you want to meet a phantom bees, meet us by? Like, right in the clear side. Oh, that was so amazing though. Uh, if everyone wants to, you guys want to do it? All right, we're meeting on the school rooftop tomorrow, yeah? What about me? I could always sneak in if necessary. That'll draw too much attention. You should just wait outside, Yusuke. What could she be scheming? Oh man, what is she scheming? She's gotta stop with the principal puffing stuff, man. I'm mad. Do we just gotta do what she says? Considering what considering what has happened, it seems you have we have no other choice. I wonder whose heart the student council president would want us to change. Doesn't matter don't matter me. But there might be a reason behind who she picks, right? Let's turn her down. Come on, guys, let's get her out, you know. I know she seems super mega like, stinky, but like we only known her for like five seconds tops, okay? I know I'm exaggerating a little bit. We gotta hear her out. She's on the box cover art, okay guys? So she's gotta be getting better soon, okay? Seems really stinky right now. Just let the thing let's let her cook over time, alright guys. I, like I was like I was hearing myself, I was like, man, I'm like Totally smoking my co my my kodo. Gotta calm down a little, you know. I wonder who it is. Okay, I wonder who it is, man. I'm gonna see what she's saying. I'm curious myself. She mentioned how she wants us to prove our justice, did she not? Yeah, she did. Then there must be some reasoning behind your choice. Please contact me immediately if you find anything out. And don't pick go picking any fights. Okay? You understand, Ryuji? Why are they singling me out? <laughs> Dude, gosh. Oh, man. I ain't making that home. Oh, it's rainy season? Hey. Uh oh. Be careful. She's a shrewd one. You best be prepared for anything. Mm-hmm. Who knows what she's been through, man. I'm gonna do everything. But feel. 
I feel her demands, man. It sounds like something crazy, man. I feel her demands, or else. Oh my god, it's over. Yeah, I'm gonna study since it's raining, right? Do I have any more things? I'll just like look at this all off screen. Oh man. Guys, look at me study, man. You see this? Yeah, I'm making good progress. And since it's raining, I'm gonna be mega smart, man. You see that? Look, the double thing. This is what I was talking about, man. It's crazy. I should be getting to level three soon. Yeah, maybe another one in level three. Eventually, we'll get there. It'll be pretty great, easy. All right, blah, blah, get some sleep. You can see what's happening. All right. Want some cash? I got a job we could do. Do you know about that Phantom Thieves forum? People said. People said when they made a request, then it got granted. Really? That sounds useful. Well, I'll pay you up. You don't understand the position you're in. Man, I got widespread corruption in this game now. When will it then? Isn't that like a thing in real life too? Oh man. Is it actually doing hey. now? I catch you, I meant to say. Hey, it's you. Going to school? I'm just heading home. The morning sun is too bright. <laughs> Who are you? Dude, there's no way. It's asking about the job. No, we know the job, right? Well, anyway, let's just ask you again. Nope. I pulled an all-nighter. Journalist. Wool East Chico. Uh, uh, oh, yeah. Ah, uh, ah, uh, yeah. Works around the clock, you know. While well, you work hard on your studies. Okay, I'll be doing that then. Well, already after school, I didn't need to answer nothing. I was thinking you might not show. Now we're here, man. So, whose heart do you want us to change? A mafia boss. Oh. Mafia? Too crazy. What are you talking about? That's what they call themselves. This group seems to be the cause of the rise in phishing scams. It's worse. Once you're in their sights, they won't stop threatening you until they get what they want. They'll force you to take part in their scams, threaten your family, and ultimately destroy your life. Oh, jeez, man. Holy shit. It appears that their victims include some of our students. No! Oh, I think we heard a little bit about they this, primarily right? primarily target juveniles. What's the boss's name? Nobody knows. Nobody the victims knows. are being threatened not to testify. So even the police can't get a grasp of the situation. That's where you want us to start? You should be able to pull it off. If you're really the righteous phantom thieves. Or is Akechi Kun correct when he says you act without justice? You're really, like challenging us, man. Did you say something witty back at her? <laughs> like, what does the song go? I'm not an AI challenging you or something? The Persona song? Please don't tell the cops. Give us the details. <laughs> dude, can you say something witty back at her and you could say that? I'm saying that, dude. Something witty. I knew you were going to say that. <laughs> Uh -oh. Their main hub of activity is in Shibuya. Oh, that's that's all the information I have. That was a quick laugh. You have two weeks. Once that is passed, I'll submit all the evidence I have to the police and to the school. I hope you don't let me down. Alright, now she's the boss. She really had the upper hand in that exchange. <laughs> don't let me down. Damn it, she was just bossing us around. <laughs> Come on, we should get in touch with Yusuke. Yeah, like how Ryuji Ryuji says, those are stinky adults, man. Bossing us around like the stinky adults. Alright, let's see. So your own sister was involved in this case. Like what? Crazy. Is she gonna be like Makoto was like stressed or something? I don't know. PG me senpai. Student Council President from Shujin Academy? Oh man, your sister, that's right. Are you saying that Makoto was sticking her nose into this phantom thief business? You never know this? Yeah, your own sister, man. Why would Makoto? Oh, Makoto, that's how you say it, not Makoto. Bringing up my sister to upset me, are you? It seems there's no limit to your duplicity. No, I don't believe me. Why would Makoto? All right, Makoto. Fine. I'll listen to everything you have to say before I decide the truth of your statements. <sighs> I'm so mad. The Mafia. Hmm. Can we really do this? <clears throat> Either way, we have almost no information on our target. Oh, we this can get it. a crime boss, so I wouldn't be surprised if he had a palace. Still, 
Well, like, we have to, like, get a victim, right? And then they can mess, like how we did with, uh, Yusuke. Isn't this a prime opportunity for us, though? How? We are in huge trouble! Even after we punished an evil man who seemed to be good, the public did not acknowledge us. However, if we take down an actual criminal, let alone a target the police don't have any answers for. Oh, right! That might make people believe in us. I get it. That means even a catch you'll have to acknowledge us as the Phantom Thieves. Oh yeah. What do you say, leader? Let's prove our justice. Hell yeah! We just gotta do what we always do. Mm -hmm. Our time limit is two weeks, mm -hmm. correct? We can't afford to waste too much time. I'll ask around Kosei and see if there are any victims. Okay, I know some girls who go to Shibuya pretty often. I'll check with them about it. All right, and I'm gonna see what I can find on the net. <laughs> that leaves our school up to you and Morgana. You figured out what to do during the whole con- Our school up to me, okay. A Moshida thing, right? I'll back you up. All right. Let's get back together at the end of the week once we've got all our info. I'll get in touch with you guys later. All right. Oh, two weeks. We're gonna take a whole We're week looking in front for of them. School tomorrow, right? Don't worry. I'm sure we'll find something new. Could I have a moment? What's up? Well, it's. I had a yearning to see the Sayori. So if you're heading homeward, I'll accompany you. Ah, oh, a principal public style, huh? Follow me home. Ah, oh, the Sayori. It seems to suit this cafe quite well. I'm glad I chose to leave it here. Yeah. I fear I have found myself in quite a horrible mess. Oh, what? What are you talking about, man? To put it bluntly, I am in need of your assistance. Please, listen to what I must say. Throughout my artistic career, there have been moments I've struggled with particular motifs or techniques. However, each of those struggles did eventually fade. Yet now I find myself in a similar situation, but the more I try to escape it, the worse it becomes. It seems I am trapped in what we in the art world call a slum. Are you aware that I am attending Kosei on an art scholarship? Such coveted grants are not given as charity. I must continually achieve within my field to remain eligible. Were I to lose my scholarship, I would likely have no choice but to leave the school as well. In the earlier days of my career, I would exclusively paint what I desired when I desired it. The only goal I had in mind was the pursuit of pure... ...or beauty. That goal is what drove me onward. Okay. I wanted nothing more than to attain the lustrous allure of the Sayori in my own work. Yet, what reason do I have now? Holding on to my scholarship? Keeping a roof over my head? Worldly oh, desires are all that spur my brush to move. And the resulting work reflects such impurity of mine, to be honest. I am unsure as to whether I can even call myself an artist anymore. You're so tough on yourself. My apologies. It seems I got somewhat carried away there. But I simply cannot accept this lack of purpose in my work. That is why I'm so upset with my own indecision. Such vague ambition is, in essence, a sin of sorts. Though I suppose allowing my young career to come to an end here would be even more sinful. I only wish to create a work I can be genuinely proud of. Just look at the Sayori, her incandescent figure, alluring gaze. That is the meaning of pure beauty. Yet no cool. matter how hard I try to replicate it, an elegance so sweet remains elusive to me. Why is that, you ask? It is surely because the painter behind the work differs. Because the soul differs. But if my estimations are correct, the soul is nothing but another way to speak of the human heart. What, then, is the heart? How does it bring forth such beauty? I must understand. <sighs> to be perfectly frank, though, I am unsure of how to do so. 
would you be able to provide me assistance? You have already brought profound change to my world. Hence, I believe you of all people may be able to bring me closer to the truth. Let's do it. <laughs> yep. You would? W wonderful. At the moment, my art teacher has yet to notice any drastic changes in my work. But I cannot hide forever. Impurity of the heart will undoubtedly seep onto an artist's canvas eventually. You gotta find it, man. I must go now. My curfew approaches. I look forward to speaking about this matter again. Another deal on our hands, huh? They call me the dealer. I don't like the rain, huh? I checked online and people are talking about it all over. Now, in my expert opinion, Lita of Class 2D is guilty, okay? You mean Lita Kuhn from her class? Wait, let's start at the beginning. What's he guilty of? Supposedly, he's been spending money left and right recently. Said it's because of some great part-time job he got. I see. It may very well be worth looking into. And geez, once one person talks, it's like everyone starts talking. Like, imagine everyone responding this quickly. That'd be crazy, man. I guess it is like our number one priority, right? Fans views. Right? Can you try asking him about it? And I don't think he'd be cautious around a girl. And in that case, yeah, I don't mind giving it a try. Although I've rarely talked to Lita Goon before. I'll be counting on you to pack me up. DSS. Alright. Only, only if it's necessary. That should be more than enough, thanks. I'm hoping for for some great things this time from Takamaki-san's world-class wonderful acting. Yep, she's got it, man. I hope this will get us closer. Get us even marginally closer to their so-called boss. I leave this lead up to you two, and I have high hopes for your acting as well, and mm -hmm, you got this. <laughs> You're both missing the point. Hey. It's true that Lita's the eyes guilty. Well, we'll need to dig up some dirt first thing in the morning. Mm-hmm. Get some big dirt digging, man. Just like how uh, that Makado person did to me. Can I go out or am I too tired? I can't go out, alright? I'll figure out what I'm gonna do. Alright, we are back. I just went studying because since it's raining all the time, I'll be getting extra points. Hey! We were able to grab a seat. Let's do some reading. Alright, I think I can read the social plot, right? Because, uh, I'm smart enough. Chinese sweet, so yeah, I got that. Let's continue reading this one. Zoro. Hmm? Although his opponent was a true villain, he still be behaved as a perfect yep. gentleman. Make sure you pay extra close attention to how totally awesome Zoro is. Hmm. Alright. Maybe I should skip this. I mean, it's just like a little bit of reading, right? Hey, hey! There was not only strong in mind and body, but he also cared greatly for the common people. Hmm, it seems you really understand the qualities that make Zoro so great. Three points? Whoa, what am I getting? Ooh, I got a rank up. They call me empathetic. All right. Cool. Oh, we're almost at the station. I'd say that was an efficient use of your time. What are we gonna learn about this time? The rumors are pretty terrible. Don't you think all that blackmail stuff is insane? I didn't think it had anything to do with me, but there are even victims in my class. Ooh, I know all about that. These guys supposedly come asking if you want an easy, high-paying job. But then if you say yes, you get dragged into some, into some real pretty stuff. The teachers or student council friends will do something about it though. People are real worried. Oh, are you talking about that post team? I wonder if she was serious about it. I heard she knew about Kamoshida and the sexual harassment. She probably won't do be too much help. Oh man. All right, we're gonna be learning something today in class. That Lita guy's here. I'll try to ask him about it. Good luck. Leave it to me. That level of motivation actually makes me a little more nervous. 
In any case, let us know if you learned anything. Alright, I think I'm gonna end after this. Oh no, we got more stuff. What is going on here? Apparently, the damage done by this so-called mafia has even reached our student body. Well... I thought this absurdity was nothing but a joke. Nah, she got the Phantom Thieves on him, man. Soon she'll become one, probably. Not only are there victims, there are even rumors that some are involved with such crimes. I've even received inquiries from their guardians. Why is this happening? Unfortunately, I do not have the answer to that. This is the greatest disgrace in the history of this academy. If it were to be discovered, this is a vital issue for the student council. Did I not ask you to resolve it? I'm doing the best I can. And I can trust you? You must do something about this at once. You're the only one who is reliable around here. Don't let me down. Oh, man. <laughs> From what I've heard, even the other students are starting to be dissatisfied with you. At this rate, you and I will both lose our roles at this school. Do you understand? I do. Please, just give me a little more time. Two weeks. And it's on. Oh, uh, this class. Kids these days. The guy who smokes me, man. So I handle. I handed a bill over at a convenience store, and they told me they don't take foreign currency. But for what I gave them was a bona vida Japanese banknote. What? Oh, what? Don't tell me young people these days don't know who Hiro Boomi is. Buma? Buwa? Ito? I don't know. I shudder to think that these will be people shouldering Japan's economy. I hope you all know your stuff. Here's a quiz just to make sure. Hey, me! Oh, man. Between paper bills and coins, which one is issued by the government? Paper bills and coins? Network? No way. You can call for help? Was that always there? Coins, okay. No way, I can literally just hack. What is this? Let me pull my hacker out. Dude, they call me Benjamin from BTD6. Right, it's gotta be coins then. I trust the internet, right? Dude, you guys better not let me down. All of the internet, all 82% of you. Exactly. Let's go. Paper bills are printed by the, the bank. And coins are issued by the government. I would have not gone that right. I probably would have said like both or something. Originally, the government made both coins and paper. Okay. However, with the ability to make as much money as they wanted, the economy fell into chaos. An independent organization, namely the Bank of Japan, has been tasked with printing paper money since. No Mm -hmm, I knew it. Yeah, I'm pretty smart. Yeah, okay. The same routine. I literally knew all of that. Right? Coins, which don't have as much of an effect on the economy, are still produced by the government. You simply can't trust a, a stinky to look after your finances. The best they can manage is pocket change. Imagine all the money you could ever want on your feet. I hope the next palace is somewhere awesome like that. Learning about the banks and all that, oh man. Hey! See, Lady Anne's going to talk to Lita. Yeah. You're gonna back her up, right? Yeah, I see him. Alright. Looks like it auto saved. I'm gonna it save too. Because I think that's it, man. I think that is it. Yeah, that's it, man. Well, I'll see you, man.